Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be decluttering and organizing my pantry. So if you guys are into these types of videos, please stick around, like, subscribe, and let's get right into it. Okay, so I got some of these containers, which I already have some of them in the pantry already. And then I got some different containers I'm gonna open up here and see how they are. Okay, so this is what it came with. We have four of these medium-sized guys, two of these smaller ones, four extra small, I guess, and then three large, all the lids. And then we have these little stickers and a whiteboard marker so I can label everything there. So I'm thinking I'm gonna do like, flour and sugar and maybe spaghetti noodles and stuff in this guy and I'm not sure we're gonna figure it out as we go I'm gonna pull everything from the pantry and just stick it all on this table sort through it throw everything out that I am done with that I'm not gonna use or like toss get rid of everything that's expired and then I'm gonna figure out what goes where which is the hard part so I'm just gonna quickly give these all a rinse, a wash, and then, then we'll start pulling things out. Okay, so they're all here drying. And now I'm gonna start clearing this out. And I'm just imagining how messy it's gonna get, but it has to get worse before it gets better. So let's, let's get started.
So this is where we're at right now. So my table is completely full and I have this box down here full of stuff. And that was only two shelves. So I'm committed now. <laughs> Okay, so this is where we're at right now. We have all those cleared off. I just didn't do the top yet because I am out of room. My floor is getting taken over my countertops. So I'm going to start with the bottom three shelves and then I'm going to do the top after these ones are all cleaned and organized. I think that'll be my best bet and I'm sweating, so... <laughs> that but I think it'll just look better spray painted black so I'll do that later
Does anybody know what to do with these cans? Because I don't want to just toss them, but I'm never going to use this again. Do I recycle it or maybe I'll just, it'll just become a kid's toy, I don't know. Let me know if you know what to do with these tin cans. So I'm going to empty this box here and just put everything on the ground and then that'll be my kind of garbage and then I'll go through that and recycle what needs to be recycled, toss what needs to be tossed and compost what needs to be compost. And then after all the garbage is sorted through, I'm going to separate um, like categories kind of so that I know what I'm putting into the the um, bins and what I'm putting into these tubs here so okay so this is where we're at and I'm going to just stop recording like for this next little bit um, just get it all kind of organized and then I'll show you guys where I'm at and then we can start like wiping things down and filling these containers and then putting them away which is the more fun part. This is probably getting a little boring and repetitive, so I'm just gonna speed through this. Okay, I didn't get too much further, but I have all my teas, my breakfast stuff, supplements, supplement stuff like um, protein powder and collagen and stuff. And then I also just threw those coffee filters in there because we have the Nespresso now, we don't use those. And this container is pretty full of tea and coffee, but we do still have our coffee pot in case we have guests that like to use it. My mom doesn't really like our Nespresso machine too much, so I'm just gonna keep that in there because we don't use them very often. Our canned stuff, um, we have like our chips and stuff up here. And then over here we have um, kind of like treats. We have like our popcorn, jello and um, some cookies and stuff uh, we have both of our Tupperware that I haven't touched yet because um, I'll just do that after and kind of reorganize but I know I want to keep those still in there we have taco stuff and then some of those quick dinners our parchment papers and blood bags and stuff which I may or may not transfer to a drawer if I get one cleaned um, but I'm just gonna keep that in there for now and then over here we have our baking stuff that I haven't touched. Um, uh, if I can clear out this, uh, like a drawer and put that stuff in there, I'm gonna split the baking stuff into two, possibly. But I know I wanna put the flour and stuff in these containers over there. So I'm just gonna start doing that so I can start putting stuff away and clear my table, make it easier. I'm gonna put all this stuff in those containers as well. And then I'll go from there. I'm just gonna wipe down the pantry and then we can get started. Okay, I need to figure out what I'm doing here because that guy right there just it just doesn't work for me. So I guess I can do three on each side. 
and then something back there. But yeah, I'm gonna play around with that later. I decided to put all the bins on the bottom because it's easier to just slide out and then stuff that aren't in bins, I'm gonna do on the main shelf. And then for up there, I have no idea what I'm doing yet but I'll figure it out when I get to it. And this is what we have so far. And then I have all the jars up here, which I think I might play around with still, but then I have cereal over here. And then I also put my chais over there. And I still haven't touched up. Okay, so I have two of these big guys left. And then I also have all these jars that I can figure out what to do with. Um, but right now I'm going to go through the Tupperware, organize that up, put that in the pantry and organize the baking stuff as well. All right, this is where we're at right now. So we're almost there. This is all cleared off-ish. That is the recycle garbage I have to go through. And this is what we're looking like. Looking way better. Still haven't touched up there. That is next. But so far, so good. I think I need to get a couple more of these bins. And I'm not too sure what I'm putting in these guys yet. So I just have them right there until I figure it out. But I have like all my baking stuff and some other things. And then all my baking stuff's there. So it's nice and kind of grouped together. But yeah, so far so good. So for this flour and formula, I'm just going to store it up top. The flour is just extra flour that I couldn't fit in the tub. And the formula I bought in hopes of kind of weaning him off the boob and giving him bottles. But he just will refuse to take a bottle. So I'm going to store that up there for now and hopefully try again soon. So I spray painted this. It's not great as you can see. It's not perfect but it looks a lot better than what it was before so I'm gonna stick uh, like bread and stuff in it and I'm just gonna have that tucked somewhere back there I moved these ones down here so that like all of my baking kind of stuff is up here and then those are down there but I don't know I'm still kind of messing around with it I kind of wish I splurged and got the wicker baskets, but they were way more expensive than these guys that I got at the dollar store. Um, they don't look bad. They just don't look super great, but you know, for now that this is gonna work great, so. And then this is up there. It's not perfect, but it is a lot better than what it was. And I'm not done yet. 
here's what the house is looking like the counters i have to break down these boxes they're empty i have this stuff on the ground that i gotta find a place for i'm gonna tuck these guys somewhere and then over here I had all these in the pantry because I normally store them in my stove but because I'm getting a new one I took them out um, and they've been in the pantry and I'm just gonna keep them there until we get our new stove hopefully this week and then those will go underneath the stove but I still have to find a place for all these guys here I'm thinking in one of these cupboards and then this is just a box of random stuff that I have to go through. I have a faucet. I was gonna change out the main floor um, bathroom faucet, but I am kind of liking the silver in there. So I'm gonna go stick this underneath the sink upstairs. I think I'll switch out that one instead. And I have to find a place for this. But so far, so good. Okay, so I just stuck everything that I needed to find a place in the pantry on the counter so that it's all contained in one space. This is pretty much cleared off. It just needs to be wiped down and reset. But I still have this stuff that I, I'm gonna stick in the pantry. It's just not gonna look very pretty for a bit. I think I'm gonna keep that in the bottom too. But yeah, it's not gonna be perfect but it is a whole lot better. So I think I'm pretty much done. I still have this stuff that I have to go through. This is just kind of like tools and random things. Like I don't know why there's food coloring in there, but just random things that I'm gonna go through. I have to tidy up the counter space make the table wipe it all down and then go through the boxes and the garbage and the recycling and deal with all that but i figured that's kind of boring so i'll just do that off camera and i'm just gonna show you the final the final pantry so up top we have all of like the liquor bottles and stuff back there in the corner it's a little messy but i think i just need to grab some more um of these little bins just to keep it out of sight I have all the paper towel there. This is my favorite section for obvious reasons. <laughs> Looks really good. And then I moved those little containers again. All the cereal, tub of wear. This is just some um, blended rice krispies, like edible sand for my baby to play with. Just had some leftovers, so I packed it away for next time. All these bins. all those bins and then down here I still have the pans right there that I'm gonna move into the new stove when it gets here hopefully this week the convection oven this guy right there this guy's still down here because with our stove being broken we use this quite often and I didn't want to tuck it away uh, right now, but that will be moved later. I still have this bowl. I have no idea what to do with right now I think I have to clean out a cabinet or something And I can stick those in a cabinet, but for right now they're fine here and then some drinks and some vinegar and stuff Just down here. So it's not perfect, but it is so much better <laughs> But yeah, take this guys as like a sign to tackle a room or a space in your house that needs decluttering and organization. I was dreading doing this pantry for a long, long time, but now whenever I open it up, it's gonna be super nice. And my baby just fell, so I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna end things off here, guys. Um, if you clicked onto this video, thank you so much for watching and. Yeah, I'll catch you next time. Say bye. Say bye. <laughs>